I mean, the good news is, is we, we got three weeks before we really play and the scoreboard really counts. Uh, so we got a lot of work to do. Uh, you know, just way too many critical penalties today would be the biggest thing. I mean, just a lot of critical penalties on both sides. Uh, kickers were really poor today. That's probably the biggest disappointment because they've been very good in practice. I've been kind of cautious with them in practice and you know optimistic and uh, you know really anxious for this day and see how they kind of respond. And they they, they really had a bad day. Uh, Teasdale had a good day, but uh, you know our kickers were, were inconsistent to say the least. Uh, very capable. I mean, you know, based on what we've seen in practice, we're we're, we're in good shape, uh, but. But today they just didn't handle the, you know, the just a little difference in environment, I guess. Uh, and so we got a lot of work to do to get them ready for 85,000 in here. Uh, that's for sure. But I think they're the right kind of guys, and I think uh, I think it'll all work itself out. But uh, that's probably the biggest disappointment. That and the critical penalties. Uh, we had uh, a couple of big tips that led to picks. Uh, Marcus Edmond made a great play on a pick six. It was a really great play. Uh, had some big play. Had some. Had a lot of good things. I mean, you know, when you when you when you're repping three groups and you're you're uh, uh, not truly game planning against the opponent, you're just kind of you know, running your stuff. Sometimes it doesn't match up, so you can't really get a true evaluation. Uh, so you have to really evaluate each player and and their particular job and, and uh, not get so caught up in maybe the group uh, because you've got a lot of different people mixing in. So, you know, we'll see that as we go through uh, the tape. But a lot of good things. Sharon Peak, you know, really, really good day. Jordan Leggett, uh, nice play. Ray Ray, uh, Dion had a big play. Travion had a touchdown. I mean, there was a lot of good plays. Deshaun, I thought, was excellent uh, all day. Um, you know, the tempo wasn't anywhere near what we needed to be offensively. That was another thing I was kind of disappointed in. It was just our, just our overall tempo uh, of practice. But, uh, had some good runs, Wayne Gallman, uh, Fuller, all of them. Uh, Ty Dye, uh, uh, you know, Adam, everybody, everybody uh, ran the ball. I thought effectively at times, but, uh, but, but to me, you know, the, the, the critical penalties, uh, the turnovers, uh, some of the missed assignments we had, you know, those, those are things that get you beat quick. And, uh, but, uh, you know, it's a, from my perspective, it's, it's just looking at one side, you get a little different deal, but we're looking at the whole thing. Uh, we got some work to do, uh, but, but that's okay. And again, we got three weeks to get ready to play, and we'll be ready to play when it comes time. In your mind, in your mind, even if you can't report that, in your mind, do you have an idea? Amit, uh, he'll be back uh, when school starts, uh, as far as back on the team. Uh, he's done everything that we've asked him to do. I'm really pleased with you know what he's done. With all of his off the field uh, and responsibilities that, that he needed to take care of, and he's gone way above and beyond what we've asked him to do. So uh, he'll be back, but you know, then he's got team discipline, and, and uh, you know, he'll play when we run him out there. But it, it, it's gonna be a while. But he could, he could play in the first game. He could, but he won't. No. <laughs> sure, he could, uh, but not here at Clemson. He won't. Individually, who, who might have been some of the winners and some of the losers today? Uh, yeah, again, it, it's it's until I see the tape, it, it's just really not fair to give you a true answer. I mean, there was uh, some guys that just jumped out. Uh, you know, I thought uh, I thought Sharon. It was good to see him finish some plays, show his speed today. Um, I saw some I saw some good things. You know, we had a couple guys getting fights. And, that, you know, Ben was having a good scrimmage, and all of a sudden he gets in a fight and he's thrown out of the game because that's exactly what's going to happen in the game. You know. Uh, just kind of lost our temper. That's that's you know we're two weeks into camp. These guys are they're tired of each other. You know, they're together all day every day, and they're beating each other up every day. And you know they're ready to hit on somebody else. And so you know we had a couple guys uh, lose their temper out there today, and, and he was one of them. So now he's thrown out. Uh, tried to make it as game realistic as possible. Today. Uh, so you know guys have to be disciplined. And, and we were an undisciplined team today. It's just that simple. Uh, but but there was. Having said that, there were a lot of good things. We, we, I thought our backs did a nice job. But Sean Watson was outstanding. Uh, you know, you look over on your know, Shaq. I thought DJ Reader made a couple of really nice plays. Um, uh, you know, uh, TJ Green was, was having a good day. Uh, kind of tweaked his ankle a little bit. He's okay, but, but he was having a good day. Marcus Edmond was a bright spot. Uh, you know, just 
there's a lot of individual things, but uh, you know, big picture wise, not not what we need to do.